What is up guys, Zach Scott here, playing The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. And I was thinking about what else we have to do. We have like two or three stables just in this region to do. So I was thinking we could go ahead and finish up all the stables in the world. And uh, including all like the little, you know, investigative reports and whatnot. The stable trotters are here. Fantastic. And, uh, but I'm looking for the dude... Who says sore long? The dude who's doing the, the reports with me. There he is. Hey, buddy. How's it going? Great stories here, but what? But what? Oh. Partner, you're here. I should have known you come to the stable, too. Anyone with a beak for sniffing out news. That's what I have, a beak. Anyone with a beak for sniffing out news can tell this place has potentially god of horses, suspicious events at the nearby laboratory. We could ink a week's worth of issues about the going-ons in this place alone. Huh. But I have bad news, and the headline is no leads on princess at this stable. No chirps, no warbles, nothing pains me to leave knowing how many articles I could have hatched here. There's nothing to do but take wing and head for another stable. As for you, partner, why not rest at the inn till daybreak? Don't want to be stuck outside with the late-night monster crowd. Anyway, off I go. Soar along. So really, there's nothing to this one? Really? Really? There's, okay. I mean, I'll check in. I'll visit the well. That's what I do best. It's only a matter of time for what? Just how long are they going to stay there? And they have, they may have spotted us spying on them from the cliff. What should we do if they come all the way up here? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't see you there. I've been preoccupied with the monsters that have settled on North Akala Beach below the cliff. Thinking about what would happen if they came up to the stable has me worried. I can't even focus on my work. I've been trying to find someone to go drive them off, but everyone I've asked has refused to help. It seems that kind of skill and confidence is in short supply. Anyway, do you see the big tree over there? Yes. If you look down over the cliff from there, you can probably see the monsters. It's an intimidating sight, to be sure. Uh. Everyone keeps saying not to worry that they won't come all the way to the stable, but I'm not so sure. I don't think I'll be ready to be able to relax until those monsters are gone for good. All right, so yeah, we'll take care of them. Uh, oh, there's another Korok. There's so much stuff. Um, <laughs> I get overwhelmed these easily. We'll check into the stable too, don't worry. But let's go, uh, where was this tree? There's a sign guy over there. So this is going to be quite the adventure. We're going to do a lot here. Um, if I can finish up all of the... Things I need to do, that would be fantastic. You think that's a Yaga Clan guy up there? Probably. Let's go see what the uh, monsters are doing up over here. Over the cliff here. Uh, where are they at? I see the fox. Where are they? Another Korok. Where are these so-called monsters? My guy's freaking out, but I don't know where the monsters are. Okay, someone threw something at me. What is that, an Octorok sound? What is that? Or, or, or unless you mean those, oh, those, oh, on the boats. Who am I fight? Who am I fighting though, for real? No idea. Um, where's your? You know, where do we need to take you? Where do we need to take you? All the way over there. That's not too bad. Yeah. Uh, the, you know what? I I think I'll just carry you. Like I said, it's not too bad to walk down here. But I guess those monsters are in that boat. It would be what we have to do to take them out. And uh, so, although no story to be had at this particular uh, horse stable, according to Pin, I, I can at least do the side mission. At least I can save some Korok, etc., etc. Et cetera, et cetera. And uh, I'm, I'm guessing that those are the monsters that they're talking about, the uh, ones at bay there. And so I'll go. Whoa, hey buddy. So I'll get over there. Run. <laughs> he's like, run. I think I can just walk past this guy. I don't know. He's gaining on me. I hope. Maybe my team can take care of him. I don't even know. I don't know if I can swim out there. I, I Okay, anyway. The point is, we're on our way. This is like the slowest method of doing it. I just didn't want to build anything because like my resources are a little bit low, I think. And uh, we're not that far anyway, really, when you think about it. So yeah, I don't know how many stables I have left to do. I know I have at least four... But there might be more. 
And I think if we can get them all done in this episode, that'll be fantastic. Then I won't have to worry about going to stables and doing the stories and whatnot. I still have a lot of hearts. There's my friend. Yes, indeed. My worry is I get over there and I can't quite do much because it's like I uh, everything's wet. So I might need to build the glider, which is fine. This way I won't waste Zonaite. It's not even glider. It's, it's whatever this is called. Bike. I only have nine Zonaite, so yeah. And then we'll take it. We'll go defeat these monsters. I, I think this is what we're supposed to do. I probably could have just walked out there. Look, look at all the stuff that's here. Wow, this is this is this is eventful though. Monster forces. It's just me. Break that. I mean, this guy's not really wait ready for this. Get off this boat. There you go. Who's left? Who's left? This guy is left. Don't grab that. Don't grab that. Nope. Stay. Stay. Thank you. Oh, is that going to explode? That's going to explode, I think. Use that to yourself. Into the water with you. And then... Saw someone flying around over there. I don't know that anyone else is coming this way. Let me pick up some, some materials. That were maybe dropped moblin fangs, moblin horns. Uh, whoa, look at all these fish and a treasure. It's a big fish supply. These are fishermen monsters. Oh, nice. Steel Lysel. That's a really good one, too. Let's ditch this. Uh, uh well this one's mm, that one's good too let's ditch the night spell i'm probably not gonna be using that if i'm gonna get things like this i'll take some arrows though all right how do i get up there i think the better question is how do i get down here and grab all these items not that it is raining which is annoying it's going to impede me, but this one's a ladder, so that's cool. Here, let's get up here really quick. I can probably just travel from here. And then, of course, there's this big beast here. Oh, shoot. Oh, that one missed. This is like one hit wonders. It's not quite the terminology. That was easy. And then, uh, who else? Oh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. Look at that thing. That thing's super cool. Let's see what, uh, can I just put that, that on the Master Sword? Yeah, let's, uh, let's see, let's see about that. That'd be fun. There you go. Now that's a master sword. I want to get over to the rest of these monsters. I don't know if there's anything at the peaks here. Guess not. I don't really see anything. Uh, so happy trails. Let's go over here. I'm just wailing on this guy. He doesn't even know. <laughs> like, no, don't cook everything. I need that stuff. Bouncy. Oh, that's a bouncy stick. That was good. That was easy. One more left. Oh, my master sword. Oh, it still has it. Where is this guy? 
That's too good. Monster forces have been defeated. The gathering pirates. Not so, not too shabby. Where, where was that treasure, by the way? Uh, let's see, is it up top? I literally don't know where that treasure is. Let me ascend. Before we do, though, let me pick a different weapon to put this thing on. Um, I don't know. I literally don't know where the treasure is, so... That's over here. Great. Whoa! I missed it. I missed it. No. No. Little, little wobbly there. Alright, then we head back. Oh, wow. That's kind of cool. Let's ditch uh, this. We have a lot of these. I think it'll be easier for me to just fast travel back to the shrine. Then we'll check in for the night, come back in the morning or whatever. Because he wanted me to check in, right? So maybe I could do that. You know, what, what time is it? I, I mean, I could sleep a full day. It's 11 a.m. <laughs> Not a big deal. I'll just check in for the full day. I mean, he wanted me to. So, you know, who am I to say no? Also, check out this well. Get this Korok dude back home. Oh, there you go. We wouldn't stand a chance against those monsters if they decided to attack the stable. Maybe I should look for a job somewhere else. South of Kala Stable might have some openings. But I did it. I did it for you. What? You defeated every last one of them? Hold on a second. It's not that I don't believe you, but I need to check for myself. It's the only way I'll sleep at night. They're dead. You weren't kidding. Here are all, here are all their guts. <laughs> I can't believe it. There were so many monsters before, but now they're gone. Well, you're just amazing. I'm sorry. I'm just so surprised. I mean, you don't look all that strong. But you've been such a huge help. I can already feel the stress those monsters caused leaving my body. Thank you. Hey, that reminds me. Do you have any, any a pony points card? I do. Uh... Let me just add two points for you to show my thanks. Great. I got a reward available. I'll also stay, I'll give you this too. An Endura carrot. Yeah, the... There is supposedly a favorite of the horse god Melania. He lives a short distance away from the stable, in fact. I... I planned to ask him to help with the monsters, but I was going to give it to him as a gift. And now that the monsters have been handled, I'll give it to you instead. It's a really valuable carrot, and it doesn't grow around here. Be careful not to accidentally eat it. Ah. Anyway, I should get back to work. Thanks for all your help. And then what say you? Thanks for coming in such bad weather. Welcome to the Isakala Stable. And I get a pony point. Great. And then that's really all. <laughs> uh, so I'll get my reward. I don't need a horse right now. <laughs> Skip. And then I'll check in. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if there's a. C I don't know if this is gonna do anything, but he was wanting me to check in, so I'm like, I maybe I'll check in. And I do. I'll do a uh, Melania bed. Let's do, let's do the Melania bed. And wake up morning energy and a mystical message. So uh, wake up in the morning. I mean, maybe it won't be raining. It's raining in real life for me today, but. I am Melania, the god of horses. I hunger for veggie cream soup, a meal made with carrots or pumpkins cooked in rock salt and fresh milk. Bring me the food I crave, and I will enhance your horse's abilities. <laughs> All right. That's a cool message, I guess. I mean, so he's giving me recipes. Basically, I'm paying 50 for a recipe and to feel more rejuvenated, basically. And I get a pony point, right? That's the cool part. I have just not been leveraging these stables, so... Uh, one point, sure. But I also got a reward available. It's five in the morning. Let's get my reward really quick over here. And then what? What is it? Is it an extra slot? Oh, oh! An, an additional horse. All right, great. Ah. 
Uh, a knight's saddle at 23 points. Oh, cool. I didn't know he hit 23 as well. Ah. A knight's bridle. That's cool. Three more cool. points. An extravagant saddle. Excellent. I've been doing good things here, huh? Let's go check out the well. Then we will... Uh... What's that person doing over there? I'm, I'm so skeptical now. I have a lot of these glowing cave fishes. All right, let's see what we got here. Hey, you. No, I thought you. Let's see what's on the other side of this. Oh, wow, what is this doing here? That's interesting. Uh, so actually, this is perfect, because I actually have a uh, I'll, I'll turn it in for a stamina vessel. And then um, I will also do the, the the Will of Sages or whatever it's called. And I think I want to strengthen Miniru because Miniru has been doing a lot lately for me. And I'm curious if it's strengthened while I ride it. I don't know, even know. But I think Miniru being strengthened would be helpful. So let's go ahead and uh, there we go. I got a f like three full stamina wheels now. That's good. I'll start working with on hearts uh, more often now. And then, but what about what about the sages? Come on. Let's see. Miniru. Sidon will probably be the last. I don't know though. There we go. Go and bring peace to the world, of course. That's what I do best. I don't know. Let's just go up. Get me out of here. Another well under my belt. And then let's check out this Korok who needs help. I'm curious what this guy's all about. Strongest in the world. What is this girl's all about? Hmm, that's an unusual weapon you have there. Where did you get it? I made it. No kidding, I make weapons too. I've been using all sorts of materials trying to make the strongest weapon in the world. Tell me something. Have you ever heard of the monster they call a Lionel? It's a huge beast with a body like a horse. You wouldn't believe how many times I've seen someone try to ride a line on a Lionel's back only to go flying. I actually spotted one of their kind northwest of here near the entrance to Temple Tempest Gulch. But I wasn't able to pick a fight with a monster like that strong, agile, and did I mention they can shoot fireballs? The best I could do was turn tail before it caught sight of me. If you could only get a hold of that, of that Lionel's horn, uh, I'm sure I can make the strongest weapon in the world, but I'm no fool. I know I haven't got the skill to take down a Lionel. Hmm, I just wish someone else would make the weapon of my dreams and show it to me. I'd give them a nice reward. Strongest in the world. So what is this quest exactly? Is it to make a weapon or defeat that specific Lionel? Uh, let's see. Strongest in the world. She believes a weapon made with a line of horn. So I have a weapon. I mean, I have a line of horn. Uh, if we look here. Let's just sort by fuse power. These Lazalfos horns are a little bit better, huh? I mean, what does a Lionel horn look like? The one I have... Unless I spent it on something. Dude, where is my Lionel horn? Uh, that's a Stalnox. That's a Gleok Frost horn. I'm not so smart. I don't know where this Lionel Horn is. Diamond, Gleok Wing, Horoblin, Liable, Saber Horn, okay. Let me just hold and then drop it. And then uh, I guess I'll choose a weapon that would be good with it. I don't know, the Royal Halberd. So 16. Sure, I'll do the Royal Halberd then, there we go. Let's see. Check this. Check that horn. Hey, that weapon you're holding, let me see it. Sure thing. You can have it. Uh -huh. 
That's no doubt about it. That's a weapon made with a lion horn. Nice and sharp, too. You could slice through anything with this baby. That settles it. That This is the strongest weapon in the world. I have stronger. I'm honored that I got to see such a stunning weapon up close. Here, it's the least I owe you. A per 50? You could have it for 50. I'll sell you this for 50. Just because I'm a nice guy, I wouldn't regularly do it. Then again, the world's a big place. Who knows, maybe a stronger weapon is out there somewhere. Someday I'll return the favor and show you a weapon of my own making. See ya. I hope you do. Where's your friend? Apples. Where's your friend? All right, where is it? Not too far. Let's, uh, I don't know if that's another situation where I just carry you. Because again, it's not that far. But I worry that there's like a big gap. Is there a gap coming up? No. Okay. I bet you I could just launch this guy and it would be pretty good. Yeah. Let's do that. Do I have any? I, I had a bunch of rockets. There we go. Going this way. <laughs> he, tur he turned. <laughs> okay, there he goes. There he goes. <laughs> that that didn't really help at all, honestly. If we're just if we're being real, that wasn't that great of a thing. Um, where'd he go? Oh, there he is. All right, let's just go. I mean, I guess what am I worried about? Maybe a few monsters over there. I need to reach my friend. Yeah, he sees me. Oh gosh, he's coming for us. He's coming for you. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I can't seem to shake that off. All right, whatever. <laughs> Don't, it doesn't matter. And then we'll go back and we'll do, fix the guy's sign. And by the way, yeah, I saw some comments. Was, someone said it was almost like I'm stalling finishing the game. It's not that I'm just trying to get everything done before I finish the game. You know, I don't want to finish the game and then have to go back and do a whole bunch of stuff. I just want to get like a lot of the main stuff done, a lot of the big side quests done, so that like I feel like accomplished. You know what I mean? All right, the stables up there. Is he gonna get back on? You almost hit my friend. There you go, you're welcome. You can grab a couple of these on the way. And then the sign guy. So it is it seems to be taking me a little while to I mean like we've almost spent 25 minutes here at the first stable doing everything associated with it and then we got to go on to another stable very soon not the greatest thing but whatever uh where's the sign guy oh that's beetle there's the sign guy Let's see what he, okay, yeah, so. It almost seems like, you know. <laughs> Not quite. If I put that there, kind of raises it a little, right? So there's that. And then if I kind of, an idea that I have here is to kind of put little, that's not gonna work. Yeah, that's gonna work. That's gonna work better at least.
<laughs> and then <laughs> I really don't know, man. I'm trying to cover all angles here. Perfect. Let's see if that holds. That may not hold up at all. But whatever. I want him to let go. Whatever, dude. All right, that was not great. All right, let's see. That was weird. What happened there? That one does not want to stay on. All right, you know what? What if I, st that's funny that it's stacked like that. What if I double them up? Good. Attach it right there. Oh, come on. Sign guys are so annoying sometimes. Get this rock out of here. Okay. That, mm, that's perfect. You just don't want to do the work. That's perfect. Mm. Whatever. Will that stand up? There you go. No, it's up. It's still up. Oh, man. This guy's killing me. Um, okay, so much better idea then would be take one of these big pieces. Remove this. Uh, yeah, I mean, that's, dang it. All right. My goodness. How about right over the, no, that's still in the center. All right, this has got to be good. That's not going anywhere, right? Come on, let go, let go. There you go. I, I mean, I had the basic idea down. It just took me forever to execute it, so. Give me all you got. I need some water. Perfect. All right, what do I get? Red rupee, of course. <laughs> Sleepover ticket. I don't use those. I'd rather pay and get the pony points. All right. Next up, there is uh, another stable. Like, if we just keep going, there's like three stables up here. If we just keep going, there is another stable. Uh, where is it? There's like, they're so close. Let's just take the trail. Which, tra which, which trail? Yeah, that's the trail. We'll find something on this trail. I'm sure of it. I think there is another stable super duper close. And there wasn't a mission to do there, so so long. 
We're still on the right path. That's good news. Plus, I think there's a shrine down here. No, we did that shrine. Never mind. Was that wait? Was that shrine near a stable? Let's see if this shrine was actually near a stable really quick. That would that would be funny. This might be the South Akala stable. I don't I don't even know. No, I don't think it was. No. <laughs> I think it was over here. Uh, so let's just travel there. There is a shrine in the... Anyway. Maybe we'll do the shrine later. I'm so focused on these horse stables this episode. Try to get all the pins requests done. So yeah, I think it's over here. I think it's really close to this. Yeah, see, there's a shrine over there. That way... But which way is the way... There is... I think it's over here. Am I right on the money? Uh, probably. Probably. I just see this shrine over there. It's almost always a shrine, but I mean, maybe even always a shrine by each stable so, so that we have a fast travel point. Oh, hi. What the heck are you guys doing here? Oof, got me there. Alright, that broke. No real surprise. Let's do another another one though. This guy's so powerful. Man, his shots really get me. Man, he's really got me. Let me back up for a second. Pop him in the oh, he moved. hit him in his eye he's gone there we go that was annoying that was a tough battle but that's a nice horn all right yeah I know I know there's a shrine coming up and then Uh, yeah, the horns are good. Is there anything up here? Oh, we have to ascend. Let's see what I can find. There you go. Look at that. Look at that. That is cool. What is this? There's a big boy guarding this. Oh, nice. Let's ditch uh, this mighty construct bow. All right, and then, of course, the shrine coming up is over here. And I'm guessing there's a stable in this area. The horse. What the? <laughs> what the heck, dude? All right, why, why is this guy here? This weapon's kind of weak. Yaga has been messing around with me a lot. I de believe me, I definitely see the shrine. And I don't know. Oh, there's the yeah. There's a the shrine. There is. Hey, let me go get the shrine really quick. <laughs> I love the constant notification of the shrine. I know I can turn it off before anyone says anything. I know. 
but I, I shouldn't want to because I mean I want to <laughs> know where the shrines are all right Great, I'm naked again. I had a bunch of health, but that thing took it away from me. So now I gotta fight for my survival. Proving grounds, the hunt. Wow, I start with a wooden stick, perfect. The hunt. Wait, what is this? What the heck is this? Homing cart. Oh. I'm not so sure how this works, but this sounds really fun. Go get him. Go get him. I need to maybe use homing carts. <laughs> no, go, go, go get him. Go get him. <laughs> Whatever. I don't. <laughs> I like this helping cart being on my side. Okay, go, go get the rest. Yeah, there's more over there, dude. <laughs> Don't. Uh, let's see. All right, let's go. They're they're gonna be this way, guys. <laughs> Go get them, guys. <laughs> All right, let's see how this goes. Hey, you're free to come this way, too, with me. Are they fighting him? I don't even know. There you go. Have fun. Oh, crap. Whoa. Oh, crap. Missed. Well, this is not great. Uh, hold on. One at a time, please. Thank you. Oh, God. I was really hurt. Oh, no. Oh, no. Constructs, please save me. <laughs> oh, no. I don't, okay, hold on. Hold on. Let me, let me see. There's still a guy fighting over here. Pop. Dude, he's still alive. Oh, no. <laughs> Okay, guys, rock hammer. Thank you. <laughs> Goodbye to you. I'm actually quite hurt. Good. I don't know why they did. No. Ugh, I want the big stick. All right, cool. Uh, oh shoot, yeah, go get this guy. Come on. These homing co these, these guys aren't doing a good enough job in my opinion. I thought they would be going after him and just like taking care of the, oh my God, he's right behind me. All right, let's, let's go with the long stick. Here we go, long stick, please. Get, not you. No. Yeah, get him, please. Holy cow. I know, it sucks because I my I don't have any items to heal. He's coming for me. Ugh. This is such a weak thing. Alright. Ooh! No! <laughs> <laughs> I thought this would be better. Thank you. Oh, God. He's right behind me. Stop. This is so fast. Oh, my goodness. Uh, here we go. Soldier spear. Oh, 
get him. Oh, wow. Uh, here, I got another arrow over here. I don't think I have any health. These things are so weak, I thought they'd be stronger. Oh, crap, I missed. This guy likes to chase me. I don't like for this guy to chase me. Thank you. Soldier, okay, now go find someone else to pick on. I don't know what in the world to do. All right, two arrows. I'm gonna be honest, you guys are not that helpful. <laughs> you guys kind of suck. <laughs> At least with that particular thing. Does he have bow, what does he have? Does he have bow and arrow, what does he have? I have bow and arrow. There you go. That was a good hit. Do I have anything, like, here, a long stick, let's fuse this. What, no, fuse. He does have a bow and arrow. Dude, there's still another guy. Oh, there he is. <laughs> oh, crap. I don't have any. There you go. No, 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 no. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I think one more hit I would have been done for. All right, great. You return my equipment. Give me. I, I need a chest. There's a chest here somewhere. I don't even know where. Oh, wow. Uh, it's there. There it is. Perfect. <sighs> All right. Great. It's a good spear. Is that all the chests? Yes. That triumph was a little difficult, but we made it through. That was a little scary, honestly. That was like... <laughs> Alright. But anyway... Light of Blessing. Nice. And... Um... I don't need to. I, I don't. I always skip that. Okay. So let's go to the. Uh, what is that up there? Oh, some trees. <laughs> all right. <sighs> Things are all over the place, my dude. Where's your, where, where do I take you? Again, it's not that it's far, it's just that it's like I gotta do it, so. Yeah. And man, it's, it is far, it is far. Let's just do this. Here we go, here's what we're gonna do. Gonna build this thing. I know I need to get more fans. It's not that hard to get fans, it's just I haven't done it, so. Alright. I wouldn't be surprised if it showed me a cave or something here. It almost seems like it's designed to get you to go places that you wouldn't normally go. And then once you get there, there's like, hey, there's also something here. You know what I mean? It almost seems that way. I don't know if it's true. I don't see the cave yet. So if there is a, if there is a cave here, I don't know where. But the two Korok seeds, great. Yeah. I'll take those. I will. He, you know, he's no longer telling me all about you know things. Like, oh, did you know this? And I'm like, yeah, I knew that. 
<laughs> it's like the forest. <laughs> Specifically speaking about the Korok Forest. Anyway, let's go this way. I wish there was like a turbo button. But the good news is that we did get um, another shrine done. We're about to hit the uh, hit up the stable here. What is this? Hey, what? What are you guys doing? Excuse me, my turn. Please don't cut in front of others. Hmm, should I really ask about that? No, maybe not. But then again, hmm. Are you here for the prophecy from the all clucking cuckoo? Get ready for the your life to change. They say that cuckoo's words are always come true. Actually, don't take want to take my place in line. Actually, do you want to take my place in line? I have a lot of questions, and I need time to sort out which to ask. Really, you'd be doing me a favor. Go ahead. All right, don't cut in front of him. All right, do your thing then. What the heck? Oh my gosh. What do I do? I mean, I'm just kind of waiting. Maybe this is involved. Maybe this is involving uh, pen. Maybe this is something that I need pen for to really understand it. Uh, let me you know a prophecy. There, yeah, he wants to talk about it. So, uh, what the heck? Okay, this way I can auto build it back. And then, you know, I can put a, a bright bloom seed on it so that it will work better. These are sorted by uh, most used. There you go, bright bloom seed. Yeah. Dang, no, no, stay, stay, stay there. It's a little crooked, unfortunately, so. I don't know. Well, can I, can I, unf can I, here. <laughs> Apparently not. <laughs> what about if I do this? It's gonna keep it, but now it's in the back? All right, whatever. I don't know if that affects the balance or not. Pen, what's up, a prophecy. Oh. Hey, look at you, partner, feeling around for leads after dark. You remind me oh. of me, so how about it? Tell me you, uh, you've got something we can work with. No, I've got nothing either, either. not a chirp, not a warble. Even if I strain the old ear holes, no sir, not the slightest peep. Mm. So what do we do when our leads go quiet and luck runs out? I suppose we've got one last resort, a prophecy. A prophecy? Ah. Oh yes, it's come to that. Good thing there's one heck of a cuckoo around here that are, speaks prophecy. I mean, we know it's hard to believe, but you've got to wonder. Oh, Look at that tall tree there, the one way up on the hill. They say folks are lining up to hear those prophecies every day, hoping to have their fortunes told. I know what you're thinking. Seasoned reporter like me, hoping to get a lead from an actual prop. Poultry will hear me out. <laughs> I'm poultry too, no. Uh, those that flock up there for their fortunes, they might know the real story here. Interview them. All right, I can do that really quick. I'm also going to, before we do that, check out the well. Check out the, uh, you okay, dude? One, two, three, counting sheep, maybe. I, mean, I guess I don't. Do I have to go in for it to count? Uh, there's a there's the real prophecy maker right here. Oh, put him down. All right. <laughs> no idea. Let's go interview the. Uh, these chicken lovers here. Ooh. Hey there, fellow. So checking out my fancy duds, I bet. Stylish, right? I'm a little late 
to fashion and all that, but my eyes are wide open now. Ooh. I was heading east for Terrytown since I heard celebrity designer Cece was influenced by someone there. But when I heard about the Oracle here, I had to stop by and see it for myself if it's the real deal. Oh. And buddy, it's as real as can be. Here's the prophecy I got. On a remote island to the northeast, thou will find great fortune. Terrytown will have to wait. I have an island to go to. I just hope great fortune means a treasure trove of clothes. All right, and what about you, Lonnie? I have so many questions to ask, I need a bit of time to narrow them down, so don't worry about me. You go ahead. Cluck, cluck, cluck. Thy name. What is thy name? I sense it. You are Link, and you are searching for someone. Ah, oh, yes. Princess Zelda. I know all. And what I know is that thou will face trials that will reveal much to you. So, will thou take these trials? I'll try it. Cluck, cluck. Very well. The first trial is... Get to the top of the stable's head within the time limit. Walk, run, fly, whatever it takes. Ready yourself. Cluck, cluck. I guess I'm ready. Three, two, one. Oh, what's the time limit, though? Here I go. Great. Okay, I have, I have time. Where's my guy? Oh, wow. Okay, well, here we go. We're taking this. We're taking this. We're getting there. I made it. You finished. I did. Good thing I had that vehicle right there. Good job with that trial. I'd say I'm impressed, but I already knew that was going to happen. So, thou, yes thou, ready to face the next trial. Only if thou overcome it will thou find what thou seeketh. So, are you going to try it or what? I'll try it. Cluck, cluck, very well. The second trial is... Bring three logs here within the time limit. Lots of trees around here. Any of them will do. Okay, so here we go. I'm ready. Let's go. We're going to bring them. Three, two, one. I got to have a sword ready to chop them down. We got a minute, though, so that's fine. Uh, three logs. Three logs. Uh, give me this sword, I guess. Knight's broadsword. There's one. All right, and then... What? No, no. All right, one... Yeah, attach it. What is happening? Okay. This is easy. These are interesting trials, but this one's quite easy. There you go. Three logs for you, chicken. You finished. I did. I did a good job, too. Believe you me. Cluck, cluck, so. You, you you tired yet or what? You've got to be worn out. Well, it's been entertaining. So naive, so trusting. I can't believe you fell for this. A talking cuckoo? Ridiculous. Is it, Yaika? Now that you're worn out, we've got you right where we want you. Everyone, get him and finish the job. I freaking knew it was going to be Yaika. And so, you know, I'll just I'll just take this thing out. Flex score smasher. Boom! Yeah. Boom! Boom! Oh. Ow. Okay, you got the drop on me there. Whatever. Where's my freaking guys? I missed. <laughs> we collide into each other. <laughs> Alright. We'll let you off easy for now, but don't get used to it. We won't hold back next time. Be prepared. Alright. That's fine. I know we have the rest of the Yaga clan to take yeah! out. Hey, there's my partner. There we go. Oh. I was just giving a good long think to the all clucking cuckoo situation when I saw everyone running around the tree here. So what's the story, kid? It was Yaga. Mm. Uh-huh, I see. Well, I had a suspicion that a cuckoo couldn't yap to save its life, but I didn't suspect that it was a Yaga clan trap. Those chumps really know, knew how to lure us in by mentioning Princess Zelda. I guess we walked right into that yeah. one. But at least this will make one heck of a newspaper story. All those who put their faith in the cuckoo's prophecies, people need to know the truth or else they'll fall for more of these lies in the future. Oracles, my tail feathers. Mm. We've worked together to chase eight of the stories relating to Princess Zelda. Yeah. There's never a time for a break, you know. I'd better make sure Tracy hears the details of what happened here. 
Go on and add this to your nest egg, partner. Great. Oh. I uh, almost forgot. Tracy's been really impressed with you and asked me to give you a bonus. Here you go. A red rupee. Ah. Anyway, get a load of you giving us a big scoop and gi giving us a big scoop and those young adults a healthy clobbering all in the same day. Not bad for a day's work. You keep that up and I'll have no choice but to keep you on as my partner for a long, long time. Put enough crowing if you want to meet my deadline. If I want to meet my deadline, I better get back to the office and start writing this up. See you, kid. Bye. Soar long. All right, Yaga's almost got me there. But not quite, really, I mean. All right, let's check in with here. I don't know if there's gonna be any other missions to do, but the important part, hope she's okay. Are you, yeah. good morning. Welcome to South Bacara Stable. <laughs> Just kidding, a bit of sheep humor for you. A place, this place you're actually at is called South Akala Stable. Since we are, We've all, always had so many sheep here. Some people, some visitors started calling us the sheep stable. So I thought, why not embrace it? And I started taking good care of the sheep. Before I knew it, even more showed up. It was like a wooly invasion, but no complaints from me. I think they're just adorable. Sadly, while I was busy making this place a utopia, our cuckoo went missing. That poor sweet bird always hated being alone. She wouldn't lay eggs unless one of us was nearby. I hate to think how scared and lonely she must be. Sometimes I swear I hear a sad squawking sound and it wakes me up, but that must be a dream. No, I know where it is. A friend to keep her company. I mean, I know where she is. How do I get her out of there? I mean, is it a mission? Is it like, uh... I know, I don't know how to get him out. Unless, I, unless, the goal, unless I'm supposed to put an, another chicken in here. I don't think I can get this one out of here. Yeah, I think I think they want me to put another one down there with her to keep her company. I don't know where another one is. I know where the prophecy one is, but that was just a yai guy. <laughs> but where's another? Where's another one? Help me find another chicken, and I'll do the the deed. I'll put another one in there. I just don't know where a chicken is. Hmm. Where be another chicken? I'll try to find it. There's another sign guy. There's the uh, trotters as well. Where's another chicken? Let's check in. Yeah. Get it? Check in. Check in. Okay. <laughs> I don't need nothing. Horse God, yeah, yeah, yeah. Any chickens in here? Just chilling out? Whoa, what the heck is this? A rumored beast. Ah. Mm, oh, hello, welcome to South Akala Stable. Sorry, I was lost in thought there. I was wondering why so many people are so interested in that. That beast is the stuff of rumors and apparently found in the South. Mm. A huge tusk creature. <laughs> it's gotta be made up, right? Nobody in Akala's even seen its footprints, let alone the thing mm. itself. There's this rumor going around about a horse god appearing at Isakala's stable to the northeast. They say it can revive dead horses. <laughs> Why is everybody so quick to believe the silliest things? Oops, sorry, didn't mean to waste your time with dumb gossip. I better get back to work. Take it easy. So if I'm supposed to put another chicken down in the well, I'm gonna need another chicken, you know what I'm saying? So... So I gotta figure that out. Anything to know? So the all clucking cuckoo was just one big hoax. On the bright side, it taught me an important lesson. Only I can decide what road to take in life. Oh. Anyway, I'm gonna start heading northwest. Maybe I'll see you again if our paths happen to cross. Oh, there's, oh, there's plenty here. I'm gonna put another one down here. There you go. There's two in here now. There you go. Was that good? I mean, was that a mission? Next stop, the horse god. 
For a while, I'd wake up to a sa okay. So squawking sounds happier. I know I probably dreamed all of that, but it comforts me to think that wherever she is, she's not alone anymore. I basically just did a mission without getting credited for it. <laughs> That's basically what it seems like. Uh, I got a cobble crusher. I know this person was mining something. I don't know if I would be disturbing them to also go mine it or what. Is my device still up there? I don't think it is. What's going on? Come on, break already. What? I found this ore deposit, so I'm going to smash it and get the gems inside. My hands are a little sweaty, so my grip's not as firm as usual. Otherwise, I'd have busted it by now. What's with that look? You don't think I can do it? Fine, then. Let's make it interesting. If you can break this this ore deposit in one strike, I'll give you all the gems that come out. So step up if you got the guts. I'm pretty confident in my skills, but with my sword, I can't even make a dent. There's no way anybody like you can break it with one strike. One hit wonder. I have an idea, and that would be to take a... Uh, a bomb and do it uh, let's see if I can hold and drop it and then I'm just I'm just curious if I, this, this will work <laughs> there, you, there you go hot <laughs> oh come on how how I was joking when I said to break it with one go I came up short because I was only using my arm muscles, but you, you <laughs> used your brain muscles. Now all I can do is admit that you won. Congratulations, that was a perfect strike. The gems are yours, like we agreed, and you've inspired me to get more creative with my weapon designs. There you go. I th I, that did indeed work. And that was my idea, so. Sign guy over here. I'm getting a lot done by visiting these things, by the way. Um... Uh, this one's an interesting puzzle because this one, I assume, is just going to straight up fall down. Uh, let's make... Maybe that? I don't know. We'll see. Huh. I mean, yeah, that's interesting. Sort of. I don't know what the heck I'm making. Okay, let me just flip it around a little bit. Let's take this. so bad I don't know what I'm making I really don't I don't know how to kind of touch this This is my idea here. Dang, what needs to happen? All right, this is a weird design, but I think I have an idea with it. This is gonna be hard to hard to hold up, I think, but. This could still fall. So how do we deal with this? It doesn't do anything. Uh, let's see. Let 
getting a little reckless with this one. Uh, let's put that there. How's this? Dude, that's just not working. Uh, I'm disappointed in what I what I'm doing here. How's this? Let's just see. Look. You look so scared. You're fine. Ah! Alright, so let's see. Uh, let, let go. Let go. Try letting go. I don't know. <laughs> exactly how it's supposed to work. At least it worked. Because sometimes it doesn't work. And then I'm just like, I have to redo it over and over and over again. Um, let's see. All right, good. Ah! Perfect. Thank you. Give me this stuff. Sorry, I was zoned out for a second. Um, red rupees, of course. <laughs> All right, with that he's off, and with that, uh, you know, I need to go see. An <laughs> I need to go see another uh, stable, I guess. Um, and that would be one. So wait, he said I've done eight. I don't know how many missions there are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. I might actually have a lot more stables left than I realized. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do them all today, but. We could go to the next stable down, which is the Foothill Stable, and that one's down. Um, well, I think we've done this one. We've done, yeah, we've done the Foothill Stable, right? And then I'm assuming that all stables that we have discovered, uh, we have, you know, what's this one called? Dueling Peaks. I'm sure we've done that one. There is a stable over here that we haven't done. We did this one, Highland Stable. There is uh, something called the Lakeside Stable over here. It makes sense. I have a, the shrine, but I don't have the stable discovered, so let's travel there and see if we can do the Lakeside Stable. And uh, I know that there was one particular stable that we didn't do, uh, which was missing goats. And that was gonna be easy just to cover. I think that was was that the Tabantha Bridge stable or the new Serene stable? I don't know. But there is a stable around here that I guess I just didn't notice before. Right down there. There you go. There you go. Another stable. Lakeside. The stable at Lakeside. These guys are having a good time. Hello, doggy. I'm gonna go check out the well really quick. Oh, it's well, no, I thought it was okay. Um, yeah, I mean, no big deal. Lots of topaz in that one. I gotta die. Wait, did I pick up a loser or not? Maybe I didn't. Oh, interesting. There's a little shelf over here. How, how did I miss out on these fish? So that was a rewarding stable to go into. I mean, uh, well, well to go into. The stable probably will be rewarding as well. But, where's my dude?
I don't see him. Unless he's up there. He might be. I can't catch a break. What's your break that you're trying to catch? Uh. For crying out loud, of all the places th th those monsters could go, they decided to settle down in those caves, our caves. I wonder if there's some way to chase them out for uh, out for the stable's sake. Yeah, I could go mm -hmm. get him. Huh? Oh, hello, hello. I was so deep in thought I didn't notice you there. You didn't happen to hear what I was saying. Monsters? Uh. I guess you did hear. There are five, there are three caves that appeared around here after the upheaval. Wow, three caves. Wow. Okay. Uh, they're all up there. One is near Corda Lake. One. There's another one next to Rodai Lake. And another one over there. I don't. I don't quite. I see one of them. Oh. Huge deposit of luminous stone can be mined in those caves, so they're popular spots for travelers, or they were. Then the three giant monster brothers showed up. Uh, those three used to be over in Terran Pass to the northeast, but now they're in our region hogging the caves for themselves. Oh. If we don't do something, travelers will stop coming here, and business at the stable will dry mm. up. I can't win. It's not as though they're, they'll up and leave, but I can up and kill them because I can oust these giants. Is there a bird in here? There ain't no bird. Where is he? Uh, let's check in. Okay, at her direction, we open a sanctuary for new animal species. It's right across the ravine from here. Uh. Ordinary visitors can't easily reach it, but with a telescope or the like, you might be able to snatch a glimpse. Anyway, once oh. again, thanks for coming in such bad weather. Oh. Got a pony point. That's why I'm here. Um... Uh. I'm good. Oh. I'm good. It is rain. It is, yeah. Oh. yeah. When will it die down? I don't even know. Get inside. There's another sign guy. I was expecting to find a bird here, honestly. Up close, if I can. I like to get a close look at the animals over there, but darn it all, they run off when people get close. Fascinating creatures. Uh, stocky build, bulky animals, all of them. What I wouldn't give to get a closer look, better yet to touch one. Oh, hi there. Didn't really notice you walk up, buddy. I've been looking across the way there. I wonder, are you curious about the unusual animals over there too? Unusual <laughs> animals. Oh, so if you're curious about them too, then you must have a keen mind. Yeah, those are kind of unusual. Uh, those are a species of animals that few have ever seen called Don Dons. They were discovered in this area. A young woman on the opposite bank has been taking care of them. She really knows her stuff. If you'd like to learn more, buddy, I'd suggest you talk to her. Speaking of new kinds of creatures, a pair of fellows visited the stable recently said they are searching for unusual creatures. Uh, they're seeking a giant white stallion and nothing less than the horse god. Unusual indeed. That stallion sounds much larger than a horse, and that god is surely much greater than a creature. Those two headed west of here towards the lake of the horse god. You could talk to them if that sounds intriguing. <coughs> Let me uh, put on this spear. Good. No more lightning for me. Sign guy as well. Here for you, even wet. I'm a little bit like, where's the bird? That's what I'm all about. I'm all about that bird. Let me see if it's up here. What? Huh. Maybe the bird's over by the animals. Bananas. Is this, is this a trap or is this real? It's real. Real bananas. Where's your dude? Yeah, okay. Uh, let's do it. Let's just build what we came here for. Or let's just do... You know what I'm saying. This is like my go-to. It's everyone's go-to, really, it seems. I know a lot of people who, who use it, so... There you go. I'm taking you over. Whoa, why? 
You're on crooked somehow. I don't know. I don't know if it's your fault, but I can blame you. Finally struck that bridge. That's scary, right? He'll be fine. Here we go. Let's try this. Gloria Bridge. Whoa. The hard part is when I do put them on crooked, it, it is a bit of a hindrance. Jeez, dude, the lighting's just like right here. What the heck is that? What the heck is that? Here, let me drop you off right down here. I am curious what that is over there, but. Also don't want to lose this. Oh, there's just a big dude. I don't know, man. I don't care about him. Let's go. Of course, of course I can't get on this because it's, it's somehow, yeah, he sees me. We gotta, oh, it's, oh, it's backwards. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, 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 ow! Dang it, dude. I was like, get out of here, go. Oh, shoot. Someone else get him then, please. Dude, he has a field of electricity around him. I hate this. What the? No. No. Get, no. Get out of here. Help. Help. Dang it. No, I, I this is, no, this is horrible. Gosh, I hate you. I hate you so much. I hate everything you stand for. Let's go. Electric Lizalfos. I guess I've never fought those before. What's that noise? What's that? What's that sound? Whoa, 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 whoa! Watch out! Watch out! I need to eat some food, some delicious food. I got some right here. Yep, as expected. Let's go back to the. I don't know where the bird is for this one. I, I guess unless he the pin is at the. I'm guessing he's gonna be at the animal sanctuary or whatever. So let's go check it out. The animals apparently won't let you get close to him, but that's okay. Oh good, the weather cleared up a little bit. No, Pin isn't here either. Where is Pin for this one? Such mysterious animals. Uh, oh my, you must have come quite a long way. Uh, the, the, this is the sanctuary for Don Dons, the new animal species discovered by Princess Zelda. Don Dons are quite precious as we've only found five of their kind in the wild. Please be gentle if you touch them. They might look intimidating, but you're, you've got nothing to worry about. They're a good natured sort. When the princess came to research the Don Dons, they used to go tromping around after her wherever she went. I think they're actually quite fond of us two-legged folk. That reminds me, did you hear that a rumor about Princess Zelda being seen riding a beast? Well, I bet that people actually saw was her on a Don Don back when she established the sanctuary. It just goes to show how much rumors can take on a life of their own. Don Dons aren't beasty, they're adorable. Can I have these? Excuse me, but you can't take that gem. Why? That gem is precious, a precious clue to understand, understanding Don Don's lives and habitats. You'll have to bear with me. It's a bit of a long story. One day, some luminous stones I picked up fell out of my bag. Before I knew it, a Don Don charged over and then, chomp, chomp, it gobbled the luminous stones right up. These animals show no interest in food, and the luminous stones, of all things, sparked their hunger. I was shocked. After a while, we found gems on the ground where the Don Don grazed. Those are the gems. Oh. Uh, where they come from remains a little uncertain, but I think the Don Don created them after eating the luminous stones. If that's if that's the case, I might learn more about the nature of Don Dons by studying those, so please don't take them. Can I attack these guys? There's only like five left. What if I make them extinct? That would be kind of funny. But where's the bird? That's what my question. Like, where is Pin at the, uh, at the, uh, I don't know. what. It, let's see if I can look at the, this is the lakeside stable. Uh, where is Pin at the Lakeside Stable? Uh, along the road south of Stable. Okay. 
So Pin is talking to someone along the road south of the stable. And that would mean... Along the road south of the stable. Well, this is the stable. Is there a road south of the stable? I literally don't know. Is there a road south of the stable at all? What are they talking about south of the stable? Uh, I'm trying to figure it out. Uh, hold on. Someone says. Uh, okay. So the someone says there's not one. I'll buy that. I don't want to spend too long, so I searched it out myself. I want to go to these caves. There's three caves to deal with. I'm running a little low on my uh, my battery power here for some reason. I might have to do a little bit of landing. Or I could just eat a Zonai charge. That always helps too. If this is sorted by most used, I do use a lot of Zonai charges, but what do they mean by used? I touch a lot of them and drop them in things. I don't really eat a lot of them. I don't know. Yeah, most used. I would I would expect Zonai charges to be up here with most used. Let's just sort by type. Alrighty, so three caves. We know there's one right over here. There's one here too. Dude, a lot of these here. If I could just get those guys dead, that would be amazing. Alright. Man, they all flew out. Hold on, hold on. Riju, 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 Riju. Where's Riju? Riju. Dang it, Riju. Where's Riju? Okay, thank you. All right, this is the beautiful part of this. This is gonna be amazing. No, read you. Why? Okay, I get so mad at read you sometimes. All right, where is the eyeball? Oh my gosh. Sort of by type. Sort of by most used. There's the keys eyeball. There you go. Look at all those keys. Come on, dude. Yes. It's way worth it, in my opinion, to do that. That just takes out so many of them at once. You get a ton of eyeballs. I don't know if that was all, but I mean, that was a lot of eyeballs. I love it. All right, great. My vehicle's here. Will it still be here when I'm back? Maybe if I put a bright bloom seed on it. So let's just put a bright bloom seed on it and then. Let's go. Luminous stones. So I'm, I'm guessing if I feed those beasts luminous stones, then. That's going to be a good thing, right? I just got to figure out where these beasts actually are. Probably go with the cobblestone crusher. There's gonna be like a lot of cave. If there's a lot of caves to explore here, then that's gonna be something as well. Perfect. No luminous stones, just flint. Hmm. 
Don't really need that, honestly. But if we're investigating these caves, then there's gonna be um, booble gems. Whoa, no, 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 no. And also giants in here, some sort of giants. I don't know what it's gonna be. Stall knocks, I don't know. Um, you know, I could fuse this big rock. Wow, where'd that go? Pick it back up, thank you. I didn't know these guys would just be sitting in there, what the heck? I know that was a possibility, honestly. Let me go grab this. There's the sleeping beauty. Uh, let's start off strong. Where's Riju? Freaking Riju. <sighs> Alright, he's, he's, he's waking up. He's gonna wake up soon. <sighs> the middle Hinox brother is what he's called. Alright, that's an okay weapon. This is even better, so let's just get over to it. No, he has armor on that leg. You don't have this leg protected. Ow, whatever, dude. Are you kidding me? What do we got? We got uh, revital leg. Like, sure, just eat. Mm. I, I forgot to bring more food. Sure, shock resistance, whatever. Dead. One giant. Some roasted trout. Bunch of weapons I don't need. Still on the lookout for, uh, you know, booble gems in here. One luminous stone. Yeah. And there's so, there's so few luminous stones in these things. I mean, you'd think there'd be more. I would at least. I was like, okay, there's like four there. What the heck? Sometimes they break and there's like nothing in there. There's another one. Flint, of course, is another good thing about these. All right. So I am looking for, I guess, a way out of here. Is that something up there? All right, let's. We got to figure out a. Uh, we got to figure out our way around here. Is there something over there? What is going on? I hate when I accidentally trigger him, because it just freaks me out. 
Okay, so I'm looking for... Oh, hold on, let's see. Let me just run in and get this guy. Oh, maybe not. Dang it. I don't know where I'm going with this. There, there's gotta be a booble in here, right? Literally don't know where. There's this hole. I guess we just be on the lookout for more holes. Oh no, there we go. There's a little area that we haven't been, I guess. I would guess the boobles over here then. In some in some fashion. And yeah, let's go up. Hey, buddy, I see you. Hi. Well, great. How am I supposed to do? Oh, you know, you know, I know how. Oh, what? What happened? What the heck? Okay, I see all those bubbles. Where is the dude himself? Where is he? Where the heck is he? There he is. Boop. Is this thing gonna fall down? All right. Let's get out of here if we can. Um. Is this it? Like what? There we go, and my vehicle is still here. This actually looks like something. I don't know what this is. This is something. Ah, I can move that, I think. Huh. Am I supposed to... What the heck? What is this for? Oh no, it's some sort of a puzzle I'm not prepared to deal with. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Hmm. There's also this. There's that one over there. What's that for? not one of them. Well, what the heck is this? This one has a bunch of fish in it. I don't know what this is. Maybe we'll... If you guys know what that is, let me know in the comments below because I do not know what that is. That's confusing. There, there's some more bananas. I don't think this is part of a trap, but we'll see. Maybe they're just talking about singular bananas. Are there, I know there's one over here. I think. What the heck is this?
Is this like a relic of like Breath of the Wild that I don't understand or remember? I don't know the answer to that. Um, let's see if I go. Where's the next cave, by the way? There's another. Th oh, why is it like this? What is the story with this? I mean, literally don't know what the story is with that. It's so weird. It's weirding me out. Anyway, let's go here and. Um, Grab that. Should be a sleeping dude in here somewhere, right? Um, I mean, that's pretty far down. I just want to see if there's like a if there's anything behind here or Actually Riju will be kind of help. Dang it. I hate that she just disappears sometimes. Well, that works actually really well. There doesn't seem to be a uh, an opening behind it, so is this the depths? No, but it might as well be. I mean, I guess it doesn't might as well be, but you know what I'm saying? It's This looks like the depths almost. Wow. This is a really dark cave. I guess you do need bright bloom seeds for caves too. You know, that's one thing that you, you forget sometimes is that, hey, caves are dark. <laughs> it's not just the depths that are dark, but IRL caves are dark too. They're big old caves. Lots to explore here. This is actually a pretty significant side mission. Wow. Holy cow. I mean, I guess I could throw in a big old... Uh... I mean, you can see the walls. That's a monster over there. Let's get a better weapon. This weapon's good, in my opinion. Wow, there's a lot going on here. Hey, buddy. Whoa, help. This guy, the youngest Tinox brother. Does that mean he's the wildest? Can't see, can't see. Hit his crotch. He dropped a royal bow already. Yeah, you're gone. You're gone, dude. Royal bows are pretty good. How come I can't carry any more royal, royal bows? Uh, what's my weakest? You know, this duplex bow isn't really doing it for me. Let's just drop this. There we go. And then so much to do here. Um, where is Riju? Riju. <laughs> that didn't break as much as I wanted it to, honestly. There's a lot of mining to do over here. There you go, now it's all broken. I mean, the good news is all the flint. The flint is like kind of like this, the secret star of this because that's a lot of flint. Where's my dude again? There you go. 
good solid three hits takes down everything there. I don't think this is a cave, but I'll, I'll check it out in a second. There we go. No, there must be something else in here. Because we got to find... Uh, we also got to find out... Where the booble is. And I mean, it's a dark place. This cave is. It's a big place, too. These caves are all big. I mean, they had me go into three big caves. It wasn't like three little dinky caves to take out a giant. I mean, I guess if I guess if you're a giant, you need a big cave to live in. Otherwise, you'll be uncomfortable. You can't stretch out your arms. Here, I'll just throw something over there really quick. Yeah. Treasure for me. That's not good. <laughs> oh, I don't like that. Really, all we're doing now is trying to find... Uh, the booble gym. Is this where we dropped in? That's where we dropped in, so let's look elsewhere for it, I guess. That area, it looks so dark. It's just like, what is happening? Like, oh wait, there you go. I found it. How did I miss? Got him. Booble jam. All right, now we can get out of here and do one more cave. Get the other giant. I don't know which giant it'll be, but here, let's just ascend. You have a perfect spot there. There you go. Go, 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 go. And then, uh, can we go up again? This might put me out on top. Or I might still be in it, because it was such a drop down. Alright, this is acceptable, I suppose. And then my bike should be down there if I still want it. Wait, so look, there's... No, no, okay. <laughs> All right. Let's take this one to the next cave. Get the other giant out of there. As soon as I figure out where it is, I mean, I don't know. It could be... It could be behind there. Yeah, that might be it. In the corner. I mean, it kind of showed me where it was. Yeah, okay, this could be it. Let's see if this is a cave entrance. No, but it's a treasure, so. I'll take the treasure, of course. Nice, bomb flower times five. Where's my bike? Did my bike like fall way down or something? Where's my bike? Where the heck's my bike? Oh, there it is. Hmm. Well, there are some enemies. 
I guess I'm looking for this other cave. And wow, I don't know where it is. Uh, where is the other cave? Is it, you think it's behind the waterfall maybe? Didn't he say there was like three caves? Oh great. Let me see if the other cave is behind the waterfall. It might be. Um, um, honestly, can't tell right now. Oof. All right, let me let me look at the missions again, cause cause this will help me out. Lower Lake. Cause they said okay, so adventure log outing to the giants, Corda, Rodai, and Kalora. So I got Corda, Rodai, and then yeah, it should be here. So maybe above the waterfall? I don't know. Could be above the waterfall. My bike's over here. That's another problem with this bike is that I just can't do anything with it if it's in the water now. But thankfully, it can come to me still. And then we're gonna get up here and go on top of the waterfall. I hope that's the answer that we're looking for. Because that lake is kind of high up. Oh, more keys. Dude, if I can if I can nail another shot at these keys, that'd be amazing. As long as they don't just land in the water here. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Okay, I do uh, read you, read you, read you, read you. I need you, need you, need you, read you, read you, read you. I need you. All right, where are they? Are they gone? I think they're gone. We got a couple. It would have been amazing to hit them all at once again. Okay, so cave wise. Oh, there's the, okay, there it is. The, okay. I see the cave. Also, it helps you find this bike because it's lit up. That's the other benefit. A one. A two. All right, cool. All right. So he, he ran this way, though, right? Saying the cave's this way? The cave is this way. Awesome. Kalora Lake Cave. There's a lot of uh, explosives over here. This one seems to be well lit. I hear him behind here, I think. Oh, let me sneak up on this lizard. It's a blue one. I don't know if I've seen the... I mean, I saw him, but did I, have I picked it up yet? Hardy lizard, nice. All right, dude. Ready to rumble? Big explosion. And that's good news right over there. So now we just gotta find the giant, because the booble is often the hard part. The giant is just a little battle, you know? Like, not a big deal. He must be down here. Hardy lizard. Where is he? 
Oh, there he is. Again, I don't anticipate this being a big deal. Wake up! Both of his legs are armored. I don't know if I can change that. The eldest. There you go. Look, that we actually took out, took out his leg armor. Boom! I thought maybe we'll get that leg armor too. It doesn't really matter when we, when we attack this guy. It seems so. There you go. Lots of explosives around here. Got your old body. Your cooked meats. <laughs> Uh, another royal bow. I mean, the royal bows seem to be pretty darn good, right? 48, yeah, Zonai. I mean, 40, yeah. Dude, yeah, get rid of... Get rid of this, uh, 30. Give me another royal bow. And then we'll grab stuff here. I don't know. I'm not so sure about all these explosives, but, you know... Whatever I can do to get some uh, flint and stuff. I think we should return. Return home. That was one hit. That was great. All right. Well, I think it'll be quickest to just fast travel back. Uh, so should we do that? Let's see. Yeah. Let's just fast travel back and then, uh, I will, I will BRB my friends. Here we go. All right. Well, let's go check in with that mission. Even though there wasn't a, um, seem to be a pin quest here. At least we had something fun to do. We didn't do that sign guy yet. I forgot about him. Where is the guy who... Okay. You have my support. Well, do I? Maybe. Let's slide one of those in there. I'm getting tired of these sign guys, man. <laughs> Anyone else feel the same? Is that not going to squeeze through? There you go. Hey now. I would I would wonder if that would be good on enough on its own, but I also really doubt it, so let's just put that there. Maybe that will hold it up. Let's see. Looks good. Looks good, my pal. All right, now give me my rewards. And then, um, red rupee, stormy meat, meaty rice balls, and sleepover ticket. Great. I gotta find that guy and tell him what I did, but also I wanna go back to the animal sanctuary. Where is that guy? I mean, these guys seem to move around, right? They're really gone? Oh. Listen up, I've got some great news. Word has it that those three giant monster brothers finally left the caves. Hmm? Huh, what's that now? Yeah. You did it? You mean you defeated all three of the monsters by yourself? I've seen enough faces in this job that I can tell from looking at one if someone's lying to me, oh. and you aren't. Oh. I don't even have to go check. You really did do it. You defeated the monsters. On behalf of us all at the stable, thank you. Please take the small symbol of our appreciation, some fried bananas. <laughs> That's it. Oh. With those pesky brothers gone at last, the guests will start pouring back in. I guess I better get back to work, huh? And listen, you've got your reward, but if you ever need luminous stones, feel free to take all you need from those caves. <laughs> and there are plenty of areas of interest beside those caves for you to see around here. Not to mention rare animals that you can only find around the stable. Take it easy. All right, there we go. Side quest of ousting the giants. It's been done. 
So will these animals eat the luminous stones and spit out, poop out, or whatever, diamonds or whatever, whatever, <laughs> other types of, of jewelry? I am curious about it. Let's go find out. And then we'll travel to another stable. Because we at least have like maybe three or four left. I don't know. So here, here's me being curious. Luminous stones. What do they look like? They're luminous. That's one way you can tell what they are. Um, and that would. Be, what is it sorted by? Type. Wow. Here you guys go. Eat away. Do you think they'll eat them? He ate one of them. Everyone's crowding and everyone wants a piece of the action. So I fed him five luminous stones. Is anything gonna pop out of him? I mean, if they do, it's slow. What are they doing? I'm guessing that they will if you feed them enough. Or maybe if you cook a meal with it or something. I don't know. I don't know because there is a cooking thing here. What happens if I cook a luminous stone? Probably nothing. Rock hard food. That's kind of fun. What a waste of luminous stones though. You guys want some rock hard food? I don't want it either. This one's gonna eat another one, right? I mean, do I get, I mean, you're eating them. I have enough that it doesn't really matter that I'm wasting five. I, I don't know if eventually they'll poop out or spit out or do something, you know, like. There's another one here. It's such a slow process that I don't even really care anymore. It's like. All right, whatever. Taking one back with me. Luminous stone, where would we need to go next uh, for another uh, stable? Let's find out. We have a, a map here. The Highland Stable is just over here. Going north, there is a Riverside Stable. There's a Wetland Stable. And there's a Woodland Stable, and I've done all those. Up here, there is a, my horse, by the way, a Snowfield Stable. There is a New Serene Stable which we've seemed to have done. There's a Tabantha stable. Uh, there is an outskirt stable and a Gerudo stable. Wh oh, I haven't done the Gerudo stable. And I also haven't done the, one of these stables. Let's see if it's this one. I have to find the goats. There are some mini stables as well. I don't know if he shows up to those. But I feel like I'm really close. The Gerudo Canyon stable I haven't done. Let's go find out if this is the goat one. And if it is, where are the goats? Is this the goat one? This is the goat one, I think. Are there are there other clues? White goats. Hmm. Chork says the bottle they kept Princess Zelda's recipe in was blown off somewhere by the wind. As a result, the feed has been given the white goats are made from 
What he could remember the recipe. I can't believe that Princess Zelda would teach anyone a nonsense recipe. That doesn't seem like her at all. It's important that we find oh. these white goats. Ah! So where are the white goats here? That's the real clue that I need help with, because I don't know. I don't think they're down there. Well, I guess they could be. I don't know where the goats are. It's been a while since I've been over here. This is like one of the first missions that he gave me, but I didn't do it. <laughs> I was just like, oh, okay, where are the goats? Unless they are, is it marked where they are? What are we doing? We're doing a, uh... I can't believe we haven't done any of these. Um. Yeah, Miss Goes Treasures as well, which is interesting. No, don't go. Okay. Find Princess Zelda. Destroy Ganondorf. Side Adventures. Yeah, this is the stable one. Um, White Goat's missing. These side adventures, I'm doing it. And yeah, this just takes me right over there to where he was. Where do the white goats go? Huh, let's see. Where are the white goats? <laughs> That's what I'm just gonna be like, where are they? <laughs> uh, the Hitino pastures on the east side of Hitino village, really? Wait, no, 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 no. That, that can't be it, though. Uh, no way. I'm, I'm trying to look at something. I'm a little confused. So, oh, there's gonna be a trail of goats. Okay, I didn't know that. Look, there's pine cones. We just follow the pine cones. I didn't realize that. I was looking it up because I was like, I don't know where they are. I thought like, and then I saw an article that was like Hatino Village. I'm like, no way, I can't go to Hatino Village and bring the goats all the way back. But this makes sense. If there are pine cones here, one, this is a good source of pine cones, and two, the goats are bound to be here eventually, wherever they are. I'm running, oh man, I'm using my excess stamina. Didn't even do that. Oh no, I don't like, okay, hold on, there's the sparkles. There's the sparkles, there's the sparkles. I mean, we're in tall grasses here, and thankfully, I mean, we're just following the pine cones. There's the goats. Hello, goats. And the bottle. Whoa, those are my white goats. So this is where they ran off to. You could have found this on your own. <sighs> there, there. I'm just so glad to see you. Are you all okay? And you're the one who found them. Thank you. I won't forget this. Oh. This bottle. This is what I was using to keep Princess Zelda's recipe safe. Let me see it. I need to check the recipe. Mm. Mm, yes, yes. Oh. Wait. Oh, no. Uh. Grind the pine cones into powder. It's not supposed to use highly in pine cones whole. I should have known something was off. It did really look hard to eat. My poor sweet goats, they must have run off because of the awful food I was making them eat. I'm so sorry I hurt you all when I thought I was helping. 
It was my fault all along. I would have run away too. I can't believe I doubted the recipe that Princess Zelda shared with me. I should have noticed my mistake right away. After all, I really do want to take the best possible care of the goats. But it's not just about what kind of food you feed them, right? It's important to show them you care with all of your heart. I swear that from now on I will take care of you all with the same kindness and compassion that Princess Zelda displays. That's the best way to show my gratitude for her sharing the recipe with me. <laughs> oh, and I really, really can't thank you enough for finding my white goats and the recipe. Ah. We're all, we're gonna head back to the stable. You take care, okay? Aye. So, hey, partner. There he is. Yo. I saw everything, partner. Oh. A perfect investigation with a happy ending. I expect nothing less from you. Hmm. Do you think it's a coincidence that the missing white goats and the lost recipe were in the same place? I have another theory. <laughs> Maybe the white goats set out because uh, set out to find the bottle themselves because they couldn't stand to eat the wrong recipe anymore. I don't think that's the case, but it does make you wonder, doesn't it? Mm. We've worked together to chase nine of the stories retaining mm. to Princess Zelda. You've really gotten the hang of this. You could probably... Uh, so, hold on. I have nine. But are there 12? A bonus from Tracy. Frog it. Nice. Ah. All right. Any good reporter dresses for the story they're reporting on, you know. This gear lets you cling to walls without slipping, even on rainy days. It'd be pretty cool to wear this while conducting an inter interview in the rain. All right. Right back to HQ. So we know there's a we know there's another um, stable in the Gerudo area, um, because that's one I haven't done yet, and I don't know exactly where it is. If I look at the map, that'll tell me though. Um, the Gerudo Canyon stable is right where? Oh, right here, about. Okay, so if I travel here, then I'll find the stable. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, let's see. What are, what are they called? <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry. I don't know. Um... There are... Okay, so... <laughs> What, is, what are those guys doing? Oh, he's painting. So there should be a stable out there somewhere, right? I guess I'll just go look in the canyon. I guess. Oh, is it hot? Let me uh, wear something to keep me a little bit cool. Yeah, there's something somewhere. There it is. So I haven't really been in this area, have I? And I bet you a stable is very close as well. Me. I don't know what's wrong with me. <coughs> Alright, skip this. So there are, there are 12, it says. Maybe I haven't done them all, even to the stables that I've been to. Oh, you know what? That's probably the case, because I probably saw some stables before I even got to the Gazette. And I haven't been to those stables through the stories. That's probably true. Hidden metal, is that what this is called? Uh, let's... Right, I started it. I meant to attach it, there we go. What do you want to bet there's something under there? We can see. It may not be, but it, what if there is? Could just be a trick. Just a trick. A nasty trick. All right, we get the idea. And then up we go. Uh, 
And then whatever this is for, we continue the... Oh, wow. I bet I gotta recall something. Never mind. Wow. To me, that spells out that I need to do something like this. No, wait, wait. <laughs> so this is now running. And then we got this. What is this? Uh, what do we have to work with over here? Probably go up here. And then. I think go up here. Yeah. To get a treasure. Yep. Great. Uh, let's ditch. I mean, it truly doesn't matter. I, I just need the item, I guess. Let's ditch, drop this. I say it doesn't matter because I really haven't been using those, but there we go. We got that taken care of. Um, yeah, what? Catch. Let me see. Let me drop a weapon here. There you go. <laughs> Will it stay? I don't even know. No, it won't. Can't seem to attach it though. You know what? You know what? Forget the rule about recall. I want out of here. I want out of here. Let's go. <laughs> Recall's awesome sometimes. Are you kidding me? Let's go. We get the treasure. This is a self imposed rule. I don't need it. I don't need it anymore. I'm freeing myself of the chains of recall or not using recall. We can use recall again in shrines. It's official. <laughs> I'm making it official. All right. So there we go. Um, and then the the stable should be right over here. And then completing the news reports of the stable should also be a thing. We just got to find, after this one, we got to find two stables I haven't done, that I've been to, but I haven't done the mission for. What do you think? There's a stable around here? I literally don't know where the stable is. Oh, there it is. It's like it's right here. It's hot here, guys. Come on. Getting delirious. Gerudo Canyon stable. They got it blocked in. Was, will I ever clean this up? Let's find out. I'm cleaning it up. Wow, you got a lot of boxes, my dude. All right, there's one. Do I have another one? I have this. This is interesting, I guess. I'm doing the job for you. I don't know how it got this bad. We can't let it stay like this.
All right. I did it. Huh? Oh, good job making it in here. I mean, it's impressive that you came all this way, but the stable has closed its doors for good. Thanks to this extreme weather, almost no one rides through here. We get very few visitors of any sort. Making things worse, Princess Zelda gave the order that everyone had to stay away from our well. But we need that water, not to mention the mushrooms that grow inside it. It's only temporary. It'll help, she said. I'll be right back to fix it, she said. And then she completely abandoned us. Oh, sorry about that. The sadness just gets me sometimes. Anyway, if you're looking for a place to rest, I recommend Kara Kara Bazaar. Just head out of here, turn west, and keep going for a while, and you'll find it. It's a bit of a hike, but if you can find some transportation at the desert's entrance, you can get there in no time. Anyway, I'll get back to cleaning. Uh, wait, huh? All the junk is gone? I wasn't sure that you, that you were up, to, what you were up to, truth be told, but clearly it was all part of a masterful removing that junk. Ooh. You saved me. Thank you. I sort of let the junk pile build and build until it blocked the entrance, which was a real problem. There's still some work to be done, but thanks to you, I can get out of this place. That said, given that I'm wearing the uniform and the stable still standing, would you be my final customer? Ah. Okay, welcome to the Gerudo Canyon Stable. You, sir, have the honor of being the very last guest the stable will ever have. And that, dear customer, deserves commemoration in the form of one pony point. Thank you. Excellent news. <laughs> Well, that appears to be the end of my time as stable hand. It's been a pleasure, sir, and I sincerely hope you jer your journey ahead is a fruitful one. Now then, I still have a little more junk to clear away, so I better get back to it. Thank you again for all of your help. What <gasps> junk do you have? Oh, I forgot about those. The stable association sent us those frames a while oh. back. They just sort of got buried under all the junk. Huh. Just let me take off the wrapping. Hmm. They're even nicer than I thought. Maybe a little art on the walls would be nice, just so the stable's final days don't have to be so lonely. How do you put art there? Hi. Thank you for helping with the cleaning. We're closed, so obviously we can't offer you lodging, but you're welcome to shelter from the weather in here. Yep, just stand around passing the time until the weather clears. Uh. Come on, Piafe. Piaf. <laughs> you could have you could have at least uh you could have left at least one bed out. Oh well. Huh? Examine. Ah, Link. That, uh, has that empty frame caught your eye? Yes. Hmm. <sighs> Big yawn. I was so focused on cleaning up, I completely forgot about these frames the Stable Association sent me. I owe the Stable a lot. After all the good years it's given me, I like to put up something nice so it can go out in style. You know, I heard an interesting story from a Rito traveler who stopped by here once. Ah. There's this local attraction nearby, Spectacle Rock. Check your map. It, the place is famous. And this traveler told me that while they were flying over Spectacle Rock, they glanced down and saw it smiling. <laughs> That's what I want to frame. What could be better than sending us the stable off with a smile? It's just a shame that I can't fly to capture that view for myself. Uh. But if I had even a picture of the smiling Spectacle Rock, I could copy it for the frame and cheer things up in here. Spectacle Rock. Oh, there's two pictures we gotta take. Okay. So, um, okay. Let's go into the well. I don't know where Spectacle Rock is. Oh, there he is. Why would she do this? Whoa, ho, ho. Hello there, partner. What's brought you all the way out here? I heard that visitors stopped coming to the stable, so this place had to shut down, but here you are. Oh. The temperature is really just scorching my feathers. But just look at you, kid. Cool, calm, and collected. Oh. I've come to the stable because my sources were chirping about a problem with the well here. Actually, they say Princess Zelda caused this problem. She shut down the well and declared it off limits. Mm. But without its water, the stable couldn't keep travelers, horses, or the workers refreshed. This well also provided a steady supply of mushrooms to folks ah. here. So why the princes want everyone to stay away from it? That's the big question. What we're short on is answers. The owner who's stuck here is just as puzzled as everyone else. And I can't weasel down the well to see what she was so concerned about. My wings are too mm. wide. Uh, I wish there was some way we could get some details, but it seems like the deadest of dead ends to me. Not to me. I can go in there. I can get in this well. Whoa. I, I can jump down. All right, what's the deal, Zelda? If that's your real name, I know it's not. Uh, let's hit it. There's a couple monsters. Hello. Ow! God, it's so painful. Uh, here, let's um. Uh... 
That is dead too. Goodness gracious, we're we're in a big trouble here then. Oh, I'm stuck here. Uh. Alright, hold on. Good, good hit, good hit. Alright. I think I electrocuted some of the, uh... Some of the guys here. Uh, it's okay. I'll, I'll still pick you up and eat you later or whatever. Silver Lizalfo's horn. So what was Zelda worried about in here? Oh, heavens. <laughs> Boom. Oh, what? How'd that miss? Show me the red. There you go. That's a terrible spear. Oh, shoot. Ouch. <laughs> Let me eat some steaks. Gotcha. This place is haunted. All right. Partner, I heard monsters down there. Are you okay? I'll be back up. Maybe. It might make me go up now. Oh, he's, he's yeah. down here. No, no, he's not. So what did you find in the well? Monsters. Mm. There, so there were a lot of monsters behind that pile of rocks. Oh. I can't help thinking the princess knew about that monster din. She must have had a barricade put up to seal away those creatures and protect everyone else. Now, why the princess didn't say so, that's a mystery. But maybe she wanted to keep any panic from spreading. Or maybe it was only a very temporary measure. But then she disappeared. Yep, a little speculation on my part, but that's got to be the story here. Ah. What do you say? Holds up, right? Our job is to follow the facts, and that's where they take us. Mm. We work together to chase ten of the stories relating to Princess Zelda. <laughs> Just as expected, partner, Tracy made the right call bringing you on. Go on and take this as your nest egg partner. For your nest egg partner. Ah. So there you go. The newspaper has been doing really well lately, and Tracy has sent us a little bonus as a result. It's nice to see that she val values our hard work so much. Go on, take it. 50 rupees. Great. We needed to make some educated guesses with our story more than we normally do, but I stand by this piece. We know our princess, after all. She had to have everyone's safety in mind. I'll get to write, ring, writing all of this up for the paper. You take care of yourself. Ah! So long. So two more missions at stables that we've already been to. And then plus I got to do the pictures for this guy. There's like a smile or something. But I didn't quite get to explore everything here. It took me out before, you know, I got to check everything out. But let's see what we got. This is still on fire. Hardy truffle. Some chill shrooms. Okay. Kind of a mushroom paradise here. Um, and then up we go. So let me see about taking pictures here, because if I could do uh, something with the camera, he want. Oh, there's a sign guy. Let's see what you want, buddy. You have my support. Those look pretty. So those would be really thin pieces to if I could slide something in there, but I don't know what I could slide down in there. I guess I just use rocks. I think that it's honestly all I'm supposed to do is use rocks here. This is, uh... In fact, that might work. Yeah, that works. That works. That works. That works. Awesome! I love it easy. I love it when those are so easy. 
so easy. Ah! Perfect. I gotta find a way to spend my money. I know I need to buy different armor and stuff. Ah. Uh. Uh. And then, what was the thing in the sky? It was... What was it called? Adventure log, side... This would probably just be side quests. Simmerstone Springs? No. A okay, so Spectacle Rock. That's just the stable. Spectacle Rock. Where is Spectacle Rock? Look at a map. I don't know where Spectacle Rock is. It appears to be smiling. Spectacle Rock smiling. Oh, there it is. Okay, so if we just get above here and take a picture of Spectacle Rock smiling, then all will be well in the world, apparently. I don't even know what the smile is, unless that means that water. But let's uh, launch up in the sky. I'll pull out my camera. Be honest, I don't know what we're doing here. How do I not? Can I not pull out my camera? Maybe if I go up here, I can just look down on it. Oh, hold on, there's a spectacle rock smiling, huh? Rockets. No, oh, dang it, dude. Let's see what this is over here. There's uh, some sort of collection. Oh, shoot, there's a dragon. Oh, man. And I can't access my camera from here? Apparently not. I still don't quite see what they mean by it smiling, so. What is this? Oh, it's Yiga related. Oh dear. I don't care about the stone talus. Um, let's go back up here. Spectacle Rock smiling. I don't know. This is a weird one because I don't really understand uh, what that means. Spectacle Rock smiling. <laughs> uh, so. Okay. Let's go back up at it again. If I, okay, that's interesting. If I look at it from this angle. Let me try again. Uh, 
Let me get uh, back over here. Is it cold now? Great. Where can I go really quick? Is there a place to land nearby? Yeah, let me let me put on some armor that makes me warmer instead of this. And this face here. I'm gonna try to land over here and see if I can get a good photo. It might be too dark. But it's super annoying. But if any picture will do, then fine. I mean, it'll tell me if it's gonna work, I'm pretty sure. It'll be like, yeah, this is a good photo. But let's land right here. And then where's Spectacle Rock? Right here. <laughs> it's not working. Is that even the right way? I don't think that's it. I think it needs to be daytime so I can see what in the world's going on. But that would require me also to... So that, wait, there's a shrine. I, hold on. There is a shrine over here, so I can always fast travel back up here if I need to. I just can't see anything right now. Let me go stay at one of the, here, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go back down to this, the, this. I don't think it's gonna be good enough, but we're gonna go back down here. We're gonna rest until morning. And then uh, if this picture doesn't work out for him, then I'll go back up in the daytime Specifically to the place that we fast traveled, so hopefully that'll work. I don't really know. Oh, man. And then we still have to do two more pin quests. I may not be able to stay here. I forgot they're closed. Dang, I totally, what, you're making more mess? Are you kidding me? First up, does this, does this work? Ah. Uh. <laughs> you're saying Princess Zelda sealed the well to keep the monsters from coming out of it? You, to save the stable? I'm ashamed of myself for even imagining that she would abandon us. She really did have our best interests at mm. heart. Come to think of it, why did it, we did have a surge in monster sightings after building the well. Uh, that only ended once it was sealed off. But I was so busy cleaning out the stable, I never even considered that might be connected. Uh, thank you for looking into this for me. Next time I see Princess Zelda, I'll be sure to thank her too. Ah. Uh, Let's frame a picture. Uh, I don't have a picture. Uh, Dang, dude. Uh, Dang, dude. Um. So this one isn't one I can sleep at. So let's just head to Lookout Landing. Let's just, I mean, I don't know. Lookout Landing has a bed. Let's just go there. We'll go back, then we'll fast travel there. It's all about managing time. Or, actually, what about, we could guess at which which other stable I need to go to, because I've been to stables before I even got to the Lucky Clover Gazette. And I bet you anything Pin is at those stables that I visited, yet haven't fully explored. So let's let's go check that out really quick. I think that's a good idea. Can I do them a little bit out of order? Um, so I bet you anything. So there's a stable, um, like right here. Do you think it's the Riverside stable? I don't know. Let's just find out. And if we've already done Riverside, then we'll try different. I don't know. The point is, we'll stay here at Riverside, or we'll just do Pin's Quest, whatever it is. And then I need to probably look at a list of quests and figure out what the remaining one is because there's apparently 12. 
I think I've actually been to this one. Never mind. Never mind. I think I've been to this one. My bad. Yeah, I think I've been to this one. Maybe. Maybe not. I'm working up an appetite. There's some tomatoes to eat. Yeah, I guess I've been here. Maybe. My dear, dear... Yeah, I've been here. Anyway, the point still remains. I will uh, camp out here, get a pony point or whatever. Oh. Oh. And then, uh, no, I, I forgot. I always forget that you have to check in over here. Wait a second. This is Beetle. Oh. Uh, let's just do regular bed for a second. Oh, I didn't mean to. Okay, whatever. I'll just, yeah, no, I, I will use a ticket. Why not? I've never used one before, although I don't get a pony point. And then let us... Okay, good. It's going to be daytime, so I can maybe see the smiling thing sooner. It's over... What the, what the heck? All right, here we go. I guess it's here. A little bit lost. I need to list, get a list of potential sightings here. Um, I've done that one. I've done that one. Highland Sable. I've done the eerie voice. I've done that one. Okay, so here we are. Let's see if I can get a good picture out here then. Um, where is this place? No, it's over here. What is wrong with me? I'm so confused. Okay, this is, this is still accurate though, right? Let's see if I get a good view from over here. This is so confusing. And all he wants is a good picture, right? So let's just find that picture for him and get it done. And then, uh, I can't see anything. It's down over here. Let's see if this works. Oh, look. Oh, it's a nose and a face. Oh, my gosh. Dude, I just realized it. Wow. Okay, okay. I just now realized this. Oh, wow. Okay. I didn't know, but now I completely see what they mean. Wow. Okay. It's kind of, okay, wow. Honestly, like I'm so lucky I went this way because I would have not found it, I don't think. Dude, that's not even close to lining up. But it, it actually lines up over here, so let's see. All right, great. Dude, I wouldn't even notice that. Now it looks like it's smiling, right? Wow. Let's zoom in a little bit. I mean, this could be so much better, but whatever. If I waited a different time in the day, it would be so much better. And then now I just need to travel to uh, this place. Uh, 
Um, let's see. I think the outskirt stable is one place I need to go. I don't recall doing that one. But I might be wrong. So I got a good picture, but this person is probably going to give me another picture to use, right? And people are coming around. That's exciting. I just can't believe that the boxes are back. All right. Good picture here. Let's frame a picture. Did you seriously bring me a picture of the smiling spectacle rock? Can I see it? Yeah, it's it's not terrible. I mean, it is kind of bad, but it is. There you go. Sure. There it is. That's exactly the picture I asked for. This this would really liven up the look around here. Is it okay if I paint a paint a copy? Sure. Thank you. It really does look like it's smiling. Yeah, every time I look at it, I smile too. <laughs> Things got a little lonely around here once the stable closed, but having this here makes me feel all warm and fuzzy inside. Now just give me a moment to whip up a reproduction. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm quite good at this, I promise. Let's see what this reproduction is going to look like. It'd be funny if it was just awful. No, that's really good. Ah. I knew it! It's perfect for the stable. It's all thanks to you, Link. To show my appreciation, I give you one pony point. Great. What about the other picture? Ah. Oh yes, and please take this too. A dish. This dish is a stable specialty. Oh. Yes, yes. I knew this sight would be just the thing to cheer me up. Reminds me of when this place was full of smiles. Still, if you ever have a different picture of a smiling of a spectacles rock smiling, I'd be happy to copy down and put it up instead. Just let me know when you want to see me f something else in this lovely frame. You tell me what you want, because there's another frame, isn't there? What about here? Oh, Link, did that picture frame pique your curiosity? Yes. Hmm. It turns out that the Stable Association sent me two frames by mistake. Kind of ironic, given we're about to close. But far be it from me to look, look a gift horse in the mouth. Might as well use the other frame to bid the Stable farewell in style. I think a picture of a giant sword stuck into a peak, into a peak at the Gerudo High, Highlands is a neat goodbye to the Stable that it deserves. Giant sword stuck into a peak in the Gerudo Highlands. Mm. Northwest of here, but I won't be able to go see it. I have cleaning to do. Besides, it's cold in the Gerudo Highlands. Even a copy picture. Okay, so giant sword in the... Okay, so giant sword in the peak. Yeah, in the in, in Gerudo Highlands. Let's see what that is exactly. Um, that is... Around here. I kind of remember this. Dude, I kind of remember this. So the Gerudo Highlands are up over here. And it's near the Gerudo Summit. So I think I would just travel here and get to it. Now, I don't know for sure where the sword is. But as soon as I find it, I'll go take a picture. I kind of remember this from Breath, Breath of the Wild. Barely. I'm not like, not like totally remember it. What's that up over there? Oh, I remember this shrine. This shrine was cool because it was like the one that's like under not shrine thing. Whatever. Here we go. I think it's over here. I I kind of remember this though from the previous game, unless I'm totally wrong about it. Is it is it really cold? I am really cold. Let's put on. Uh, I don't want to be cold. Good enough. Yeah, there it is right there. Oh, there's a dragon there, dude. What the heck? If I can just do this without fighting the dragon, that would be ideal. Let's see if this is a good enough picture for him. Move. Now that's a good picture because there's a dragon in it. That's such a cool picture. <laughs> that's so cool. He's got to be so happy about this picture, dude. Let's go back. Uh, so one, you're welcome about this one. But I think I need to go to the outskirt stable next. I think is the one I need to go to. I think. 
I might be wrong, but I think. And then let me know, you know, what what all you want me to do next episode because I'm really just trying to finish up the game before I go f defeat Ganondorf. Like, finish up the main stuff. It, I'm not going to get all the Korok Seeds before I fight Ganon. That's just something that's not going to happen. Uh, I didn't do it in the last game. It's going to be tedious. There might be a, a time in which, hey, maybe I'll live stream it or something. I don't know, but that's not going to be the plan until after Ganon if it, if it happens. So, here's a picture uh -huh. for you. This picture is way cooler than the other one. Aha, uh -huh, this is exactly the picture I asked for. This would really liven up the look around here. Yeah, sure, you can paint a copy. Uh -huh. Don't forget the dragon. So this is the giant sword, huh? It's so much bigger than I ever imagined. <laughs> I knew it was out there, but finally getting my eyes on it, wow, just wow. Now just give me a moment. And so he's gonna whip up a, repro a reproduction of this. Which is incredible, by the way. That is so cool. Ooh. I knew it. It's perfect for the stable. It's all thanks to you, Link. And then another pony point. Ah. And then another specialty oh. dish. So it's called the Forgotten Sword. Even abandoned in a harsh land, it still cuts an imposing figure. And so do I. There's fighting me yet. I, if you've got pictures of the giant sword, show them to me and I'll copy and display whichever you want. No, this one's perfect. That one's with the dragon in it. That's so perfect. The Hydra, whatever it's called. So perfect. This one's kind of garbage. I would rather we take that in a day, but whatever. Um, let's go or in a better time of the day. Outskirt stable is right. So, see, I figure I... Mm, I don't know. Maybe I did this one already. I don't know. I, I probably need to... This might be the one. Okay, so when I was looking up the other stable, someone was said said, "Well, Pin is south of the." But I was looking at the other stable, so maybe they got confused, and so maybe Pin is actually south of this stable. Maybe I don't know. We'll figure it out. Just took a drink of water. I'm pretty confident I, I have been to, I have, I have of course been to this stable. Have I not seen the well though? Is there not a well? There's a well right here. It wasn't on the map. I swear I've been here though. This, I mean, I swear I've been here. All right, anyway, point is, let's get out of here. There, okay, yeah, pins here, wow. Boo, boo. <laughs> this, that is strange. Hello, partner, you're here to investigate the rumors too? I've been hearing some interesting chirps and warbles. Oh, you're also a reporter? I just had a bit of a strange experience is all. What is it? Oh. You see, I was by the debris near the three-way intersection up ahead when a woman came up to me. Please, please, you have to help her. Her life is in danger. It would only make it worse to reveal who she is. But please, you must save her. Uh, that's what she said to me. All right. I'll go save her. Mm. The woman sounded really desperate, so I decided to follow her. But no matter how hard I tried, I couldn't keep it up. Keep up. Eventually, I lost track of her. That's all there is to it. Oh. Hey, partner. Does something strike you as odd about this person whose identity can't be revealed? Mm. And if revealing who she is is so to strangers is dangerous, could she be someone of great importance? And if her life is already in danger? Well, combining these facts makes me wonder if this isn't actually a particular important person who has gone missing. I can't be sure, of course, but if there's a slight chance, there's only one way for us to know for sure, though. We'll have to peck away at this news and see what the truth is. Mm. Now that I'm thinking about this whole thing again, why was that woman st star staring so hard at my hair? How strange. Maybe you have similar hair to me. Hmm. It's down this way, you said. Hmm. A debris field? Let's see. There's something over there. I don't see any sign, guys. Someone. This is Yaiga. 
Oh no, my poor friend, please, you must save her. Are you okay? B blonde hair. I do not know who you are, but I ask that you please help me. My poor regal friend's life is in danger. I cannot reveal who she is, for that would only make things worse. She's in hiding and unable to move. My friend is in such danger. Please, I cannot go help her all by myself. Then let's go. Oh, thank you so much. My friend is, is in hiding right now. That is the only way for her to remain undetected by those with ill intent. Uh, we should go to where my friend is, but be careful not to be seen. We do not want to draw evil to her. I will wait until, for you down this road. Meet me as soon as you can. Huh. I may not be Yaiga if, if I was expecting her to just transform. I had to fight her, then mission over, but she's down this road. Uh, let's sort by most used. I got a key's eyeball there. I don't, I don't have a bow, though. The royal bow is pretty darn good. Oh, I didn't put the eyeball on it. Oh, okay, well. Oh, ow! There's a lot of stuff going on here. This is a... The master sword. Um, I have this iron ball spear. Man, okay. How did I miss that? This guy's so strong. My iron ball spear is damaged. And that's gone too. Goodness gracious. Oh, the flux core two smasher. Somebody please, I'm, I know, I'm, let me beat this guy first. All right, now what's the deal? My apologies for leaving you behind. I was overtaken by my concern for my friend. She is resting safely out of sight. It is the only way to stay safe. I am sorry that the path is so poor. Uh, Could you possibly go to the top of that cliff? Uh -huh. We can meet right where you can see the fallen debris. All right. I'm still suspicious of this person, so I don't know, man. This seems suspicious, right? Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Oh my gosh, I gotta climb? This is a big climb. Did any, uh, did anything fall down that I could just, like... Alright, I guess I'll just climb it. So I'll, sw I'll s switch gear here, literally speaking. Oh, that's why I took damage, because I wasn't wearing good gear. Alright, there's a little... Take a little breather there. Probably take a little breather up here. Dipping into my extra stamina a little bit. Oh, crap. Uh, maybe I can take a breather up here. I think I can. Oh my gosh. Lucky me. Lucky me for real. I gotta let three of these wheels fill back up. This is a big climb. Okay, where are we going? There she is. Was it here? <laughs> it must be him then. Oh, I'm so rude, you have my apologies. Come now, my friend is waiting ahead. Oh 
What? Ah. She's waiting nearby around the debris on the opposite cliff. I will go ahead and let her know that you were coming. <laughs> it's a bit far off, but I know you'll be able to make it. So this is like a test to see, like, is this guy Link? And if, if I'm Link, then that must mean that they're going to get me at some point. The debris. Okay, let's let's go see. Yep. This is something. Let me go over here really quick. Grab this stuff. I do use that a lot, apparently. This way. I am sorry for all of that. It was important for me to test you. Blonde hair, courage to overcome a challenge, and then another challenge, and then another. Oh, and your your disgusting, unwavering commitment to do good. You are Princess Zelda's chosen bodyguard, the swordsman Link, correct? <laughs> I'm so glad to finally meet you. Now I can take you to the last stop in our little journey. <laughs> Your grave, haha. -ha. Yeah, see? Freaking Yaga clan. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. It's so hard to get these guys. Let's go get somebody. Where am I? Where is, where is he at? One dead. See, the Yaga clan. Thank you. The uh, Yaga clan is nothing because of these guys. But, you know, I, I have my climbing gear on still. All right. Uh, I'll let you off this time. But don't expect such mercy next time. Prepare yourself. Sure, sure, sure. All right. Um, hey, hey, partner. Hello. Well. Well. Um, let's see. So this is where your investigation took you. Looks like you really got yourself out on a limb here. I've been scouting from the skies trying to get to the bottom of the story. I heard that woman was luring people away. I thought I heard her voice, so I swooped on down and hey, here you are. So tell me, what have you unearthed? That's great. Uh, let's see. What's that? The woman who was asking for help was actually a member of the Yaga clan? So she was disguising herself as a villager and was trying to lure the princess's appointed knight to a trap. Oh. It really is some impressively bad luck that they keep coming after you instead, isn't it? I'm glad I don't have to write a headline like Junior Reporter Falls to the Cruel Blade of the Yaga in Pursuit of Truth. Mm. We've worked together to chase 11 of the stories relating to Princess Zelda. Mm. Getting to the bottom of a mystery will no doubt improve your reputation. Tracy will be happy to hear about your efforts. Go on and take this, add it to your nest egg. Nice, 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 nice. Ah. Ah. And then, um, let's see. Tracy was really excited about it. Good. And then, let's see. I think I gotta go to the uh, new Serene stable. Anyway, here's the bonus. The job itself is rewarding. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 100 rupees, great. Anyway, it's time I took off and turned those unusual details into an article. You take care, partner. So long. So I think the new Serene stable is, uh, let's see. Let's find out. New Serene stable is up over here in the map. And if I do this, where I don't know where it is. Yeah, let's do this one. So here we go. The uh, and then once this one's done, we'll be done with the episode today. It's been a long episode. It's been a long episode for the past several, but I've been trying to like really wrap things up. So I feel comfortable going to get Ganondorf. Uh, there's Stable Trotters. And I have been to this well. There he is. Unbelievable. Oh. Careful there, partner. You went, you went and scared all the little birds away. You go storming around like that and it won't be just the birds you send flying for the hills. It's fine, though. I did hear some interesting chirps and warbles mm. from them. I don't want to say this too loud and start a panic, but rumors are spreading about Princess Zelda that she's been seen riding some mysterious mm. beast. It's said to be a mountain of a beast, too. One with huge, brutal tusks. Okay, I heard that I heard that story before today. 
Um, my little reporters had never seen something so frightening. Of course, what made it far worse was that it seemed like the princess herself was controlling this terrifying mm. creature. I find it hard to believe a beast like that could really be lurking in Hyrule, but if this terrifying monster exists, then the implications make this a very, very huge huh? story. You know, there were guests at the stable talking about some kind of rumored beast. My little bird informants told me that there had been a number of sightings in the subtropical region in the, in the south. If we want to learn more, we should dive beak first into this stable and others to see if there's any truth to these rumors. I learned about Don Dons. Hold on, you're saying you've seen the beast that Princess Zelda was rumored to be riding on? Huh, a new species called a Don Don. I suspected it would be some animal that no one had ever seen before. There's still something missing, though. It'd be a crime to put out a story in this state. Uh, could I talk to the caretaker you heard that story from? I want to see this with my own eyes. It's never a bad idea to get a second opinion on things, and that's why editors exist. <laughs> anyway, let's meet at the site. I'm counting on you, partner. All right, so we're going to the site, which we, we actually went to today, which is great news. Right over here, the lakeside stable. And then we will... Um, we should be getting this the all the the froggy set done then, right? The froggy armor? Probably. So let's uh check it out really quick. Um Hold on, I'm searching for something. I'm trying to see if a particular store that I was wanting to go to is open. It closes soon, so I need, I need to make a phone call, uh, but I will BRB. All right, I'm back. Let's go over to this area, and this will probably be uh, the last one, right? Was it over here? Yes. And then let's drop in. Uh, Pin's probably chatting with her, maybe. We'll see. Oh, whoop. Yep. <laughs> whoop. Such mysterious animals. Oh, look. Look, I left. Okay, great. They poop later. Uh, sun <laughs> they probably they, they dropped the, the gems, but they didn't let me see it. Because maybe it'll be too gross. Ah, sunshine. I just hope it sticks around. Oh. This is a sanctuary for Don Dons, a new animal species discovered by Princess Zelda. Don Dons are quite precious as we've only found five of their kind in the wild. Please be gentle if you touch them. Oh, yeah. So we've heard this before. And then... Uh, hey, partner. Mm -hmm. Huh? Hello. Mm. Ah, I see, I see. So it was one of the rare animals here that Princess Zelda was seen riding. And in fact, the princess was also researching these creatures. Uh -huh. Wow, rumors really can get out of hand, can't they? I mean, it's hardly a mountain of a beast, and all that talk of brutal tusks was just plain wrong. Such gentle creatures. That's why a good reporter must confirm the details before they go to print. You did a really good job, partner. Mm. We worked together to chase 12 of the stories relating to Princess Zelda. Ah. I can't hear the chirps and warbles of my little birds anymore. It seems like this was the final rumor about Princess Zelda. I'm going to report this to Tracy. That means this is probably the last addition to your nest egg, partner. 300 rupees. Nice. Ah. I don't think there's a reporter anywhere else in Hyrule who makes the kind of money we're making. <laughs> we're making a lot of money. <laughs> I wonder if gaming journalists who play this game are like, man, I wish I got paid that much to cover this. It really goes to show how much Tracy, I mean, how much the newspaper values you. Mm. If I'm being honest, though, I have a feeling our days of swooping in on scoops are at an end. Sniff. Oh, some water must have gotten caught in my, under my goggles. It is wet over here. Ah. It really was a blast, partner. And that's left... All that's left is to head back to the Lucky Clover Gazette and let Tracy know the job's finished. Ah. I'm going to hurry back and get the real story published. Take care, partner. Ah. Soar long. I'll miss the soar long, that's for sure. And then I think they pooped these out. Wow. Some of them are just flint, though, so keep that in mind. Um, anyways... Now, uh, I will head back yeah, to the Lucky Clover Gazette up here, and uh, where is it? There it is. And then have a chat myself with Tracy. Maybe I'll get the last piece of armor, the froggy armor that I'm probably never going to use, but <laughs> I'm like, what, 60 hours in the game? I don't have all the froggy armor. I've used it like once. I don't know. But we'll see. I mean, you probably use it like two or three times. It would be interesting to get some more armor upgraded all the way, though. But I think I'm going to have to fight in some fights to do that. 
So, uh, where is, did I fly to the right spot? I did, okay, good. Oh, there it is. And then let's head over here to the Lucky Clover. There you go. Maybe we can relax a little. Tracy. Wow. Aha, our th trusty reporter. So, Link Pins filled me in all, on, on all the latest. We're relieved that you managed to get to the bottom of every one of those rumors about Princess Zelda, and our paper circulation is stronger than ever. I'm almost speechless. Oh. Enough of that. You probably just want what I promised. Well, fair enough. Here's what you earned. A froggy hood. There we go. Mom. What do you think? Pretty good, huh? That will really help you stick to wet surfaces without slipping. In the end, we didn't actually uncover where Princess Zelda is, but now I know just who to call when we get another good lead. Until then, Link, you keep doing what you do. Your part in all this will be clear enough soon enough, I bet. As for Pin, well, I've given him some time off with pay. Well deserved, too. He did a lot of reporting. I did tell him, hey, you say something nice to your partner after all this. I think I put him on the spot, Link. He looked at me in such an odd way and flew off with barely a sore long. He was right in the middle of writing a news article, too. I can't say I know what that was about. He's bottling something up, maybe. Oh. Oh. He misses me, I'm sure. Uh, so, well, I had a great time uh, completing this. So, who knows what's next? Let me know in the comments below. I'll come up with something. I'll probably go to Terrytown or whatever. Maybe do that. But thanks so much for your support on this series. I'm getting, I'm getting through, guys. I'm getting through doing all the important stuff, in my opinion. And uh, so I will see you all next time for more Soar Long. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help the channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join on YouTube and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop. Come back next time for more.